How you doing, Chris? I'm all right. How about yourself? Well, not too bad. Good, good. Just wondering if you would read that underline there for me. Okay. That's, yeah. Uh, where's the, this is uh, Dr. Richard Warshak, leading professional parent, parental alienation. Okay. You've seen this in my son. You've seen, you have testimony from uh, a physician okay. on how damaging this is to my son, sir. Okay. When are you going to help my son? Okay. Well, we're, we're in the process of, uh, of trying to help your son. It's been over a month. You called me in there and forced me to miss a final failing a class. Uh -huh. You forced this on me. Okay. And it's been over a month and you haven't done a damn thing. Can I have that? Yeah. I was going to make sir. a copy of it, but that's... Oh, yeah. If you want to make a copy, by all means, okay. sir. That's fine. So, we're, in the, we're, we're, we're trying to help your son. And basically, one of the things that we, we, we talked about... I guess what I'm asking most... Okay. Go ahead. You forced me in here immediately. Uh -huh. Immediately. Come in here, you can't see your son. Mm -hmm. But you haven't done a damn thing in over a month. You're aware of this. This is impacting him. You need to do something. Okay. When are you going to do something? He okay. needs to be removed from that talk to be given an ultimatum. Power, sir. When are you okay. We're not going to be your son unless we have more information, okay? You, you have testimony from a doctor, from a physician, okay. that he's being hurt. Okay. He's being emotionally injured right. because of this toxic environment. Right. You're not going to do anything about that. That's okay. emotional abuses you have posted right over there, sir. Okay. When are you going to do something? Well, we're in the process of trying to rectify it, okay? What and exactly what, are you doing? One of the things we're trying to uh, organize this meeting where you guys can kind of get together and start, start working on improving communication. And we, I assume you mean you and Tiffany. Right, Tiffany yeah. Pimley, who's worked on the previous two incident reports with Michelle, who you said they have a relationship. Why would you have someone who's obviously so biased okay. on this meeting? Okay. Well, they and know each other. They know each other. Not. I mean, why would you have someone so obviously biased okay. in such a meeting? So well, I, I don't think she's biased. Okay. You said they have a relationship. Yeah. Right. How would that not create a bias, sir? Okay. They maybe, have a relationship, sir. Maybe I should have said that, that they know each other and they work with no, each other. No, but that's okay? not what you said. You said uh, numerous uh, times they have a relationship. Okay. So relationship to me is they know each other, okay? I know her. I don't have a direct line. I've actually been refused that, that number. Okay. Why the obvious sexual bias here, Joe Albro? Okay. Well, we're in the process of trying to help your son, okay? Has she agreed to a meeting? I, I, I don't know, Nevada. We're, we're still working on it, so. She's, um, we're, I'll have to try to figure out, um, there, there's a no contact order right now. No, there's, sir, there is not. Okay, there's no, okay. My First okay. Amendment rights have been violated by the courts because of two corrupt attorneys. I have documentation of these corrupt attorneys as well. They've worked with you mm -hmm. with false allegations of abuse mm -hmm. to try to remove me from my son's home. This department is corrupt, sir. Mm -hmm. This department is working with two corrupt attorneys. You've ruined my first son's life. Mm -hmm. You've devastated my first son's life. Mm -hmm. How are you going to fix this for my second son? Well, we're, How are you going to put we're in the process of trying to do it. So. It's, it's been it's, over it's, a month. We, we made some, you know, Tiffany wrote your letter. She made some recommendations as far as... Um, Once again, we need counseling. My son and I need counseling because his mother has emotional problems. Okay. Does that make sense to you? I know you're not a mental health professional, but does that logically make any sense whatsoever. Well, it does. It does, okay? Kieran, I mean, basically, there, there's some reasons why you and your wife or your ex-wife don't get along, okay? And uh, we, we just need to figure out what those reasons are, you think those how we are can all work together. Problem? The reasons it is your son's problem, because basically you guys can't communicate, you can't work together, you can't... And it's, it's my son's fault. He needs counseling for no, that. No, no, it's not your son's fault, basically. And we're, we're not pointing fingers. We just want to... What we want to do is we want to work on solutions. My son needs counseling because his mother's got emotional problems. Think about this logically, Mr. Alvaro. That doesn't make any sense. Okay. Like, is is it recommended that she also get counseling? I would I would recommend that basically everybody get counseling. Well, see, okay? and that that was what was tried. Like they they're supposed to go to co-parenting counseling, but right. she doesn't want to. Okay. Well, I think that's something that needs to be so, properly revisited. And, 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 and it is. And, 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 it is back in court. Right. Um, and, and basically, maybe that uh, they didn't have the right therapist or somebody working with them. So I don't know. What the issue but is. is she cooperative with you? Is she cooperative and willing to come in here and talk? Because, you know, the impact is it's having on the child. So it's not about the parents. Mm -hmm. have to get the 
so that it's okay for the child. Right. And so you agreed to do that here. Yeah, we're in and the process so, of trying to do it. Okay, yeah. but that's what I'm asking. Is she cooperative? Because okay. if she is or isn't, should tell you where the problem lies. Okay. Do you understand? Um, I basically, we have a lot of cases here, and Tiffany is working on the case, and, and I uh, talked to Tiffany to ask if she'd, uh, and, um, and, I, and I did talk to Michelle, and you know, with Tiffany b before Christmas, uh -huh. and encouraged her to uh, to try to work on you know on these issues, you know, not put um, Tanner in the in the middle. Right. And we, we talked about uh, the possibility of trying to get to um, a family group decision making meeting where we can kind of talk about some solutions. And what did you find what, out about that, Joe? You said you'd be back response? by the end of the year. Okay. I st once again. Okay. Full of lies, the untruths. What's okay. going on here? Okay. You said you get back to me by the end of the year. You have not done so. Okay. I, I, th I think we've called a couple times. But you, the, you know, and I don't know uh, definitely if she's going to, you know, cooperate. But, but but she was considering it. You, you have know? the power okay. to make that happen. My son is okay. being hurt, Mr. Okay. Albro. Fix this. Okay. Here. The only one that can really. Um, mandated to do things is, is is the district court you forced me to come in here you and the district court are balancing back and forth as to who is accountable you two the district court and cps need to make a decision well you have forced me in here draconianly tactic i can't believe what you've done you made me fail a class so i can see my son because of false allegations mr albro and now you're protecting his mother who who lied to you Think about this, Mr. Albro. Do you, do you understand why he's obviously very, 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 very frustrated? Yeah, I, I understand. I understand. And you understand destroyed my son's life. Do you understand, like, so reports made on him, and immediately he's forced to come here. Mm -hmm. Reports made on her, and it's a month later, and still nothing's You're still letting transpired. My son get injured. You're yeah. still letting my son be abused by this situation. <coughs> right now, Mr. Albro, as I told you, I'm before the district court. They are trying to remove me from my son's life, grant her sole custody. Mm -hmm because of the same lies that they've told you. Uh -huh. The same attorneys, the same corrupt individuals have told you you've exonerated me of all these allegations. Mm -hmm. Are you gonna come to court and testify for me as to your observations of um, meeting a model father? Okay. Well, yeah, that, that's a yes I or no will, question, I, sir. Yeah, oh, yeah. I mean, uh, basically, if I get subpoenaed, okay. uh, you know, we, 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 we would come testify. And, Do you know, uh, can we subpoena you? Yeah, I can. Yeah. I will subpoena you. I know that's... I know that Tiffany, I'm definitely able to subpoena her to sure. testify as to what the report says. I'm a model father, and I'm being hindered from that. Mm -hmm. My children have a model father being removed from their lives. Mm -hmm. That's not in their best interest. That is emotional abuse, sir, and you have not done a thing about it. You've watched it for well over a year. Mm -hmm. Well over a year, this entire department. That's corrupt, that's biased, that needs to change. Okay. Please copy like, that and let's make this happen. Okay. What, what's your suggestion on the solution here? Because, you know, time is of the essence, especially if it's in court, trying to revoke his rights again. Is there a, is, is there a court date? No. Not as of yet. That just came in yesterday. The, the latest the for to... emergency. But, I mean, we, we filed, we filed Three early November. Do, do, do you have an attorney? Or no, we don't have an attorney. We don't have money for an attorney. Okay. I've been fighting this bull this ridiculous nonsense for well over a year. I've been attacked by district courts, by the Bozeman Police Department, by friggin' CPS, the same individuals that stole my son and ruined his life. Mm -hmm. Do you know what that does to a father, Mr. Albro? Yeah. I can imagine. Do you, do, I, I, do you I, I understand imagine. the emotional abuse that that has on the father? Okay. Not to mention the children. Mm -hmm. When are you going to do something? You're stating right there, emotional abuse is is abuse. And There's nothing I mean, in here for fathers. Mr. Abro, you say you say you are trying to do something, but I mean, do you understand like the frustration when a report is made on him and it's it's immediate. You guys act immediate. You lied to your son. You must get down here. You don't get your visitation. That is so, psychological abuse. That's why I was brought in here. Yeah, and and, and it had to be immediate. You okay. know, well, I can't meet you today. I have class. Tough. You have to come now, or you don't get to see your son this afternoon. And so the same thing, I saw this little boy, he's, he's, <laughs> he, the other day he woke up from a nap and it was like, he's like, like you can just see, like I'm not supposed to like you daddy, mm -hmm. I'm not supposed to, but there, I don't see anything wrong. You can mm -hmm. see the torment go on in his head and that's not okay, yeah. you know, and we've tried, I, like I said, I've tried to contact Michelle. Let's meet. Let's have coffee. Let me hear your side of the story. Let's, let's do something. This yeah. is a new year. Come yeah. on. 
Well, that could be Let's kind of a, a maybe a, a first step as far as maybe you and you and Michelle. And, and I'm more than willing to that as well. Well, I'm just we're just looking for solutions. And, and that's the what I'm. Solution needs to be removed from a toxic environment. Okay. Okay. Period. Yeah, we you don't. Were, you did this to me, Joe. Help me understand this. Okay. How? This is friggin' terrifying that a department would be so sexually biased. This is disgusting. Mm -hmm. Why would you force me, force me, make me miss a final and fail a college course? Okay. You did this. Force me, come in here right now. Okay. Or you can't see your son this afternoon. Why would you do that to me, but you won't do a thing? This isn't about Michelle and me. This isn't about the parents. It's about my son. Mm -hmm. He's being abused. When are you going to resolve this? Yeah. That's the purpose of this department, sir. Well, we're, we're trying to take some steps, okay? But, like, Why can what? you be so draconian and with me and force me? If you want to see your son, you'll do this. Jump, jump now but you won't do anything with her. No accountability, no enforcement. Well, we're, What's going on, Joe? We're working on it, okay? We are. I, 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 I can't tell you everything we're doing with Michelle, just like I can't tell you everything we're doing with you, you know? I can't tell Michelle, okay? I surely hope that report hasn't been out, because if that's included in the court case, that's a whole other bag of worms. Well, it's not out. I mean, I, 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 uh, as, as much as you, I want that report out, too, because basically, you know, I've, it's I've got pain a, in your know, butt. What? <laughs> it's pain in it your butt. Pain. So, but so how hey, are you doing? Good. Hi. Mark, um, okay. No. No, that's not Mark. Okay, no, my bad. That's Bill. So, Bill. Um, you, you probably need to see somebody, don't you? A Bonnie. Yeah. Okay. I don't know if she's in or not. We've kind of been playing tag, and I okay. just wanted to go. Over okay. One of her I'm going to make this copy, okay, and then you. I'm going to um, see if Bonnie's yeah, there, and then I'll be.